fight, the fight You did it in a fight last time Motherfucker, you're addicted to your life You gotta fight Alright, coming up next is the UFC Heavyweight Showdown He's one of the more accomplished strikers in this division. Sprawl and brawl, whatever you want to say, he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. It does not matter how he accomplishes it. All he wants to do is be on his feet and at range, hitting you with the beautiful jab, staying away from the grappling exchanges. You don't accomplish all the things that this man has accomplished over the course of his career without understanding distance. He has great distance management, which then in turn allows him to land all these beautiful diverse kicks, spinning back kick, jumping high kick, so many things he possesses that he will try to use tonight in this fight. Yeah, if this turns into a kickboxing match tonight, so, most people so, believe, yeah, his opponent is in a so world of trouble. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, champ. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem Abdul-Jabbar uh, to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once. I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. Or till the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Three years apart, with the same height and some differences in reach. All right, now to get us started, Ladies and gentlemen, here's Bruce Buff. This is the main event of the evening. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 116 pounds. Fighting out of Tacoma, Washington, USA, Assassin. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! All right, so lofty expectations for this matchup as round one gets underway. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but on the other, truly a fighter who can do it. And that guy will usually have the advantage on paper. When you're a striker at this guy's level, that will normally balance out whatever advantage the other guy has. Able to check the high kick. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Oh, brutal knee to the body. Oh! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. So you gotta be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't wanna mess around for too long. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Lee's attempting to pass here, but he's denied by the defense. Well, you gotta stay busy on the bottom. He's doing it here, nice punch. Well, he's up, but oh, is he hurt. Great punch.
trying to kick the leg out. His head's still attached to his body. The last time I saw an uppercut like that, it was Overeem versus Ndani. And you know they still haven't found Alistair Overeem's head. Beautiful kick. There by Lee. Got the single collar tie. Ooh, big shot to the body. Leg kick. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Went for the inside leg kick. Just unable to quite find that ring. Seconds to go. Oh, Superman punch lands. Uh, single collar tie here. Five minutes in the books. All right, so there's the end of the round, and the tide has officially turned a huge head strike to stun his opponent. We'll see which corner can adjust here moving forward. I mean, they've got to be celebrating. They've got to be happy. Everything's working. But the other side has to be concerned. They have to figure something out, make some sort of adjustment to try to change the tide of this fight. Oh, big punch land. Oh, and there's a kick now to the body. That one blocked by Lee. Big kick. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Back to his patented kicks here, but just out of range. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand. Jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man, let this guy have the whole thing. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Nice. Big leg kick land. Well, a really good second round for him thus far. After a somewhat lackluster first round, he has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. Beautifully timed and place kick there by Lee. Pretty good right hand. Nice hook lands. Oh, big knee there. Oh, nice right hand. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single follow tie. And there comes the separation now. Went for the inside. Oh, see, he's rocked. That was a beautiful hook. It landed perfectly, and it hurt his opponent very bad. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. Oh, nice jab. Whoa! Lands a good combination. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down. Oh! oh! And just like that, the fight is over. Unbelievable. Oh, my goodness. 
what a fight. I'm not sure if that's the way he drew it up, but a huge result for him here tonight as he gets the win by way of knockout. And that's about as good a one-strike finish as we've seen here in the UFC in recent memory. I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming. So a big, big win for him here tonight. So there he is after a monumental knockout turned in here tonight. That is one they will be talking about for quite some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest. At four minutes, 44 seconds at round number two, declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Oh, well, there he is after a huge knockout win tonight. You going to the after party or what? I mean, I'm heading over there right now, John. <laughs> I'm asking the producer.